That summer afternoon, locked away in my room, alone with the sharp blade, honed to gleaming razor-sharp perfection by grandmother's automatic knife sharpener. The towels lay spread upon the floor, along with a ball of ice, the tourniquet, the peroxide, the bandages, all that I would need to bring my psychotic madness from twisted fantasy into the realms of the most heinous and hideous reality. I paused, took a deep breath, then another, and down with the blade. It had been more difficult than I had imagined to cut through the bone, but I, I, I put my weight onto the handle, and the blade finally made it through. My left index finger now lay completely severed, twitching ever so slightly. The star, just above the knuckle, squirting out blood, heart pounding, vision blurring, covered in, in, in sweat, almost, almost blacking out. Have to get control, must maintain. Several excruciatingly painful moments afterward, after tending to my new self-inflicted mutilation, I, I wrapped up the severed digit ever so delicately, and I placed it within the box addressed to my beloved object of desire. Oh. She, she says she doesn't want me anymore, but she's going to get me one piece at a time. <laughs>